Hello and welcome to a quick unboxing video from salesbug.com. Today we are going to be looking at the Scythe Big Suriken 2 Revision B. Now, this just arrived recently. Um, you might remember that um, I've got the original Big Suriken 2 with us as well. This is the Rev B. So it says that B thing on the um, box. Now, they made slight revision, uh, slight revision, yeah. Um, we shall be looking at that, um, but predominantly, pretty much everything looks very, very similar to how things were before. Uh, this is, by the way, the third generation one. The, there was the original uh, Big Shuriken, which was an excellent um, product on its own. Uh, with the Big Shuriken 2, they added another heat pipe. And um, with the Revision B, we shall be looking at uh, what modifications they have actually done. Um, and uh, we shall compare the two side by side as well um, at one stage. So let's um, get started with the uh, unboxing. Now, here we have it. The big shuriken comes in the you know traditional um, uh, shuriken. Uh, sorry, um, side packaging that's how they always come in let's open the pack first thing we see the usual um, cooler laid like that good side pull that out Put that there for a second okay, empty box Manuals, instructions, and so forth. Various mounting hardware. Okay, and again, there's some um, thermal grease over there. In case if someone's wondering, back plate. And that's about it. Now, let's look at the features of the um, cooler itself. Okay, what I'll do is, I'll unbox this as well, and then we'll put them side by side and compare them, see how uh, how they match up. Okay, so these are the two products out of the box. That's the um, original one, and that's the Rev B um, side by side. Now, I've been through the um, specifications. The cooler themselves are absolutely identical. Um, the f some some places they say that the um, revision got a newer fan. They did not. Um, this is the same slipstream fan. Um, you know it, and that's a good thing because this formula is proven. Um, I know a person who bought these um, and is using happily with a um, 2600k Intel 2600k. And um, although I told him that. This may not be the cooler for the job, but it pulls it off. In, even in a hot day, it ke keeps his um, CPU pretty cool. So that's that's impressive. Um, th th for the job um, they're required to do, these are, um, I mean, they've they've proven their um, reputation. There's there's no doubt. So the thing is, if they have not changed anything, um, this is the sa essentially the same thing as that. Now, so what what has changed? The only one thing that has changed is the support for the LGA2011. In other words, you get one extra page that tells you how to install um, on a LGA2011 socket and just happens to be a few additional screw and a little um, spanner in there um, to mount the um, cooler on a 2011 um, socket. Other than that, anyone buying a Shuriken, um, Big Shuriken 2 Rev B, or if someone had a, a Big Shuriken 2, the um, original one, this packaging over here, as you can see, um, they are essentially buying the same product. Now, this means that as these line up, the um, model number, specific model number is 
what is it there we go scbsk2000 and this is scbsk2100 so if um, anyone is purchasing this one as they're going um, out of market and so forth they might be able to grab some good bargain if, you, if they're not going to use it for um, 2011 there's absolutely no reason why you know you can't go for this and you know have to go for that sort of stuff um, so between the two the only difference is a few screws and um, a little spanner that that'll, that'll allow you to um, I, and of course um, uh, although the mounting plate looks exactly the same I've, I've matched it up the holes match up and all that um, and other hardwares they they are also very much identical to that um, yeah but um, just a few different screws and so forth um, allows you to mount this on a 2011 socket if you're not going to be doing that you might as well go for that if it saves you a little bit of um, money um, so yeah there we go a quick overview of the um, of the CPU cooler um, as usual uh, they both have the same um, five uh, copper heat pipes the looping um, arrangements uh, this is a uh, nickel coated um, copper plate this is copper uh, nickel coated um, and the overall height is still 58 millimeters which is very very impressive um so that's that's a quick look at the um side shuriken uh sorry side big shuriken 2 revision b um the name keeps getting bigger same product um for more video reviews and uh, unboxing videos and so forth please visit us at www.salesberg.com thank you for watching see you next time